And they're off. Haywood's Beach hopped but did recover quickly and is vying for the early lead alongside Lemonade Stand and Port St. Joe is in between them. In the center of the course, Dominant Soul is moving into contention. Leprino is also in the firing line through the opening furlongs. Eastern Ocean is just behind this group. Istanbul is next. Perseverance is a little bit rank, moving up in between horses, right next to his fellow color bearer. It's a gap of four, back to Fire Polish, who is racing on the outside of No Slow Mo. Capital Call is second to last, racing four in front of Summer Invasion. Onto the back stretch they go. It's Leprino in the red cap, narrowly in front. Port St. Joe on the outside, and there's clear sailing for Haywoods Beach, who's now within a head of the lead. They're followed by Lemonade Stand, fourth. In traffic between horses, only two lengths off the pace. Down at the rail, Eastern Ocean, Dominant Soul is outside of that pair. Perseverance behind this group has three and a half to make up. Istanbul is two lengths behind him with less than three furlongs to travel. It's another three lengths back to Fire Polish, who has about ten lengths to make up. Capital Call is just outside of him. No slow-mo, and Summer Invasion continues to trail. Past the quarter pole and turning for home. Haywoods Beach now spurts clear. Opens up two and a half lengths. On the extreme outside, Dominant Soul trying to get a piece. Big race from Eastern Ocean coming through on the fence. Eastern Ocean trying to run down Haywoods Beach. Haywoods Beach, Eastern Ocean. Haywoods Beach clinging to the lead. Eastern Ocean second. Haywoods Beach. That's a triple for Reese Bully. Eastern Ocean was second. Capital Call was on the scene late. Fourth between Dominant Soul and no slow-mo who had some good strides late.